In the episode 4 of Tokyo Revengers Season 2, we saw Mitsuya didn't allow with the statement of Hakai leaving Tamen, and then he said to Hakai that he wanted to talk with his brother Taiju, and then we saw a little flashback of Hakai and Mitsuya where they meet each other first time, and then returning to the reality, we saw Mitsuya, Hakai, Chifuyu and Takamichi going together to meet Taiju. Where Mitsuya talked to Taiju and offers a deal that he will let Hakai leave Tamen and join Black Dragon. But in exchange he wants Yuzuha's freedom from Taiju's abuses. And after hearing that, Taiju suddenly punched him. But Mitsuya blocked it because he's very skilled. But meanwhile, Hakai was losing anxiety and getting scared of his brother a lot by thinking about his past. Taiju got impressed and accepts the offer and they make a deal. After that Mitsuya and Gang were returning to their base and then Takamichi thinks about Hakai killing his brother and discussed it with Chifuyu. And then Hakai thanks Mitsuya for what he did today. But Mitsuya told Hakai to use his strength to protect others, no matter what. And after that we saw little past of Hakai and Mitsuya together in Mitsuya's home with his siblings and Hakai was impressed how he take care of his family and help them. After that we saw Takamichi and Chifuyu together in a park where Takamichi said, he should go back to the future and look if things were not changed or not. But Chifu stopped him by warning him that there are chances that he won't be able to come back after that cause he was in the jail. So Takamichi dropped the plan to go back to the future. But then suddenly Hakai appear, saying that he wanted to talk to them. And then he told them about Taiju's past life that how he became so ruthless and also that he be Hakai and Yuzuha every time for their mistakes. But Hakai want to protect his sister that's why he takes a promise from Taiju to not beat Yuzuha and beat him instead of her. But Taiju break the promise, and that's why Hakai decided, in order to protect Yuzuha, he will kill Taiju. And that was the place where Takamichi's assumption got real, and he decided to break down the Black Dragon and Chifuyu also got ready to lend him a hand. And then we saw Mitsuya, Mikey and Yuzuha together, were Mitsuya telling Yuzuha about the offer he deals with Taiju. Yuzuha thanked him but she was kind of afraid of it and worried about Hakai and after that we saw Mikey and Mitsuya riding together to a place where Mikey told Mitsuya to relax and never leave the Taman. And meanwhile Taman leaders meeting was taking place in a restaurant where Takamichi and Chifu introduced their plan to crush Black Dragon and stop Hakai from killing Taiju. But the members didn't accept it and declined it. But after Kisaki came to them and said he will help them but Chifu refused to take help from him. But Kisaki told them that they won't be able to stop Taiju and Black Dragon by themselves. And he also said that Mikey is too weak to deal with Taiju. But after hearing that Chifui got mad and break a glass and pointed to Kisaki. But then Takamichi also got pointed with the knife by Hana. But then they accepted and got ready to work together. They goes to a club with a special member of Black Dragon and asked him by giving money. About the time when Taiju stay alone. But before he able to tell them about it. The elite guard captain, Hajime Kakunai appeared with some guards and take him away for betraying Black Dragon. But then Kakunai said he will tell everything what they asked for Mike. And then Kaseki asked him that in which time Taiju stay alone with no guards around him. And he said 25th December on Christmas Taiju will go to church for worship. After telling them he just left. Kisaki tell Takamichi that it's the only time we can stop Hakai from killing Taiju and crush down the Black Dragon. But he still didn't understand that why Kisaki is helping them to stop this all. And that's how the episode ends up. So that's all for this video guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss any awesome content like this. See you guys in the next video.